Hi guys, so I just really quickly wanted to come up here and talk to you about Colourpop Cosmetics. Um, I heard about them through another YouTuber who bought a couple of eyeshadows and a highlighter, I think, and she was talking about them in her, one of her favorites videos, and she looked so beautiful and so glowy using their makeup that I decided to go on their website and order some things myself. I was not sent anything, I wasn't contacted by the company, in case that's what you think. Um, well, it's just not, you know, it's not the case. I bought everything myself. And um, I just wanted to show you what I got and how it looks because I just got home from work and I haven't really, like, fixed my makeup or anything. I've worn it all day and I just wanted to see how it looks, um, you know, after wearing it for like eight hours. So just really quickly, just want to sh tell you what my opinion is uh, of the brand, just the first impression. So they come in a box. The box looks just like, you know, like a regular box. And then you open it and it says Colourpop. And they really do a good job kind of like protecting all the, you know, all the makeup. They don't send it in some crappy cheap envelopes. And then they all came in boxes. I just took them out. And then came with this handwritten card. And it says, hey Eva, you are our precious XOXO Colourpop. Which I thought was really cute. You know, you don't really see companies writing notes and putting it in every order because I'm sure they get a lot of orders so it's kind of it's I mean it's a, like just a cute little plus I think for them and I bought um I got four eyeshadows um I got a highlighter and I got a lippy stick which is like a lipstick and for all of that I paid $32 you get, as long as you buy more than $30 worth of merchandise, you get free shipping, which is pretty cool because I'm one of those people who hates, like, refuses to pay shipping. I'll add $30 more of, more of stuff to my bag, but I will not pay shipping. So, um, so that was cool. It wasn't really hard to pick $30 worth of everything. Um, the eyeshadows are $5. The lippy sticks are $5. The highlighter was 8 And I think the blushes and bronzers and, like, the face... The face products are um, are eight dollars. Everything else is five. So let me show you what I got. And I'm actually, well, let me tell you. I'm wearing two of the eyeshadows now, and I'm wearing the lipstick now too. So let me get closer. Oh, and I'm wearing the highlighter as well. All right. So let me let me show you exactly what I have. So, um, the first eyeshadow, and this is one of the ones I think I wore today. Is it the one that I wore today? Yep, that's one of the ones that I'm wearing today. Um, it's called Amaze. And it looks like this. And they've got literally the prettiest... It's like a mousse type of consistency. It's almost almost watery, and you think that you're not getting any product because it's very squishy. But you are actually getting a lot of product. So, it looks looks like this trying to get the light okay there you go looks like this um and I'm wearing that in my crease but I didn't really do like an amazing job today I was just rushing for work um so I'll do a better job next time then the next one it's called I love this and it looks like that I'm very into the bronze shimmery shades as you can tell and I'll swatch this one too I'll swatch it on actually the front of my hand I think it'll look better Okay, and it just looks like this, and that's called I Love This, and I don't think I'm wearing this, am I wearing this one today? Let me see. Yeah, I actually am wearing this one today, I'm wearing it on my lids, all over. And the next one is called Lovely, and that's actually the color that the YouTuber that I watched had, which is what made me order everything in the first place. And it just looks like this. It's right this one here. And it's called Lovely and it's like a very light shimmery color. And then the last one, last eyeshadow, it's called Sequin. And it looks like this. Isn't that gorgeous? It's like a coppery bronze, kind of like a coin, like a penny type of color and as you can see they're very like they're squishy I expected them to be powder so that was kind of a nice surprise actually because that's something I don't have and it's this one here 
that's very nice and then the high and they just look like this and um, you're just supposed to make sure that the containers are really closed when you're using them because well when you're done using them because if they're not because they're mousse they can dry out and then for the highlighter I got the highlighter in color spoon spoon and it's also very squishy it's also like that same type of like mousse consistency and I have it on today but it looks like this it's like a very goldish type of color and it's beautiful I'm not a huge highlighter per I mean I am a highlighter person and that I use highlighters every day but I don't buy a lot of them I kind of just use what I have which is maybe like seven or eight highlighters and I just I don't really feel like I need to buy more, you know, I just kind of, like, they all look similar to me, you know. But this one was beautiful, and I do not have one that's, like, a moussey consistency. And then the lipstick, it's called Toucan. And it's kind of like a corally red color. Um, I'll see if it says anywhere. Mm, doesn't say anywhere what it is, but I know it's a matte formula, which I didn't realize when I was buying. So it is a little bit drying. I mean, it's not like drying, drying, but it's not, you know, it's a matte formula. It's going to be matte. Um, I, that's not usually my favorite formula. I didn't notice that. I just looked at the color and I ordered it. If I had known, I'd probably pick something a little bit more glossy. But it looks just like this. Um, so, yeah. So, I've been wearing the eyeshadows all day. My eyelids are super creasy. They're super, like, oily. Everything creases and they've been lasting. So, I'm very impressed I um I used my finger for the like all of her eyelid the the lighter shade and then I used the blending brush for the darker shade and it works really well with your finger with a brush and then for the highlighter I used a damn beauty blender and it worked fine but you can also use your fingers I tried that too so um so my final thoughts is that <laughs> It's an awesome brand. I basically told all my junkie makeup friends that they need to check it out. Um, but I just wanted to mention it because I feel like not many people know about it outside of YouTube. And when I asked my friends what they think about it, if, if they've ever tried it, they all said they really haven't heard of it. So I figured I'll do like a little video just, you know, saying what I think. And, um, you know, if you're looking into buying anything from them. And yeah, so it's very affordable. So far, I love it. I'll see, you know... I'll update you in a couple of months, see if maybe they dried out or if anything was wrong with them or if I got some allergic reaction or something. I don't think I will. So far, I love them, but, you know, we'll see. I'll update you. Um, so, yeah, that's all that I wanted to say. Just wanted to do a quick video. Thank you for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye.